Good morning, YouTube. It is about 4.45 in the morning, and we are about to head to work. But first, we are going to stop at Starbucks because they just released their new pumpkin spice drinks. Um, one of them being a cold brew. So what they did is put their pumpkin spice in the cold brew, and then they put the pumpkin spice also in their cold foam, which uh, salted cold foam cold brew is my drink. So I'm very, very excited to try it with pumpkin spice. Um, and we will be there very shortly, so I will keep y'all updated on how it actually tastes. Stay tuned. Okay, guys. So, we got it. Um, live taste review. Okay. Trying this. Dang. That's actually really good. Um, it's not, like, super, super sweet, but it definitely, you can, like, you get the sweet cream, and then it's kind of like a pumpkin aftertaste. Um... And then I think they put cinnamon on top of it, but yeah, that's a 10 out of 10. Um, if you have a Starbucks near you, go be a basic white girl today. It's going to be packed. Be prepared for that. Uh, but yeah, so we are heading to work now. Oh, we also got a reduced fat turkey bacon uh, sandwich because I skipped breakfast because I needed to get on the road to get here in time to not be late for work. Speaking of, we are heading there now and I will keep you all posted on how today goes, how clients go. Everything. It's just going to be a full day in the life of a trainer, so stay tuned. Okay, so we are back from work. Um, clients went fantastic this morning. You know, there's nothing better than watching somebody, like, progress in the gym. You know, it's interesting for yourself to progress in the gym, and, you know, you hit a PR, and that feeling that you get, well, triple that when you have a client who hits, like, a PR or, or you know, whatever it may be in the gym that they're really striving for. Um, it's just, there's no feeling. Honestly, like it. So for me to be able to do this for a job is, is I'm very blessed to say the less. Um, but now we have our online clients that we need to get to. I need to write programs for people. I need to train myself. I need to eat. Um, so yeah, we're going to dive into that and I'll just keep y'all posted throughout the day of, you know, what I'm doing, where I'm going and things like that. So stay okay. tuned. So we are about to go to the gym now. Um, I'm going to show y'all what I'm going to take for a pre-workout, which set y'all right there. Uh, I'm going to be taking Broken Arrow by Rep Sports. This is a really cool pre-workout. Um, not sponsored or anything. I just really enjoy this pre-workout. It is strong, just to let you know. So, it does have about 350 milligrams of caffeine. But the caffeine is actually one of the reasons I take it. Because there is two different types of uh, caffeine in this one. So, <coughs> oh god, smoke. So you're gonna have, oh God. <coughs> maybe that's a side effect of, not a side effect, of oh, a downfall for this pre-workout. It, it definitely clouds up and it smokes and it about kills you. Um, anyways, so the caffeine, you get two different types. Um, one being, as soon as you take it, it is going to hit you and then it's going to be a delayed release so that way you don't crash off of it. Uh, also, you get a very nice pump with the citrulline. You get a nice focus from the tyrosine in here. Um, overall, super sturdy, very well-rounded pre-workout. Uh, and I really enjoy it. But I've already had some caffeine this morning, so I'm gonna do about half scoop. Uh, and that'll be just fine for me. Uh, we have a full upper body day, so we are about to get destroyed. I'm gonna record it, and it's gonna be coming in the next clip.
Okay, so I just finished up a full upper body lift with uh, my good friend Kelly Ryan, and I'm pretty dead. Uh, that that one took a lot out of me. Um, I hope that y'all try that one and y'all enjoy it. Um, take it at your own pace, of course. Don't hurt yourself. But let me know if y'all try it. Let me know if y'all like it. Let me know if it's difficult for you. Pretty easy. Now I am sipping on uh, one and a half scoops of Core PWO, which is just under a full serving, which is two scoops. Um, basically what PWO is, is an isolate protein. It has carbohydrates in there and then it has velocidol in there, which essentially helps like ignite protein synthesis, uh, which is perfect for recovery. But now I'm heading up to Nutrition Corner, see my manager Trey Dog, and yeah, maybe I'll take y'all with me. Keep you posted. Okay, so we just pulled up to Nutrition Corner and we're gonna go and bug Trey. So let's see how this goes. I don't think he's gonna like being on camera, but he'll be all right. Let's see. Trey, say hello. Hey. You know, you're on my YouTube. You, you can't be more excited than that. Is it live streaming? Yeah. That's awesome. Thanks. How do you feel about the Steelers getting their ass kicked last night? Hold on, I gotta be his ass really quick. I'm gonna wrap up this video with just kind of like a talk. Um, especially how the industry, you know, the fitness industry is going now. There's so many online trainers. There's so many, you know, nutrition coaches and this and that out there. And, you know, as much as I love a growing industry, um, I don't mind competition. I enjoy competition. You know, it makes me strive to be better than what I am currently. But please do your research on a coach before you just hire somebody that has, you know, 10,000 Instagram followers that have a six pack. Uh, you know, they posted their own body transformation or something like that, you know, or they competed in a show once. Um, you know, those types of people, they're in it for the money. You know, they, they hired a coach to diet them down for a show. They posted their show pictures and now all of a sudden they're a show coach, right? So, you know, when you want to do online training or in-person training, you know, any type of training that you are paying for, that you're putting your time and effort into, um, just do your research, you know, you can ask them, hey, what certification do you have? You know, hey, you know, you don't want to say what makes you qualified to train me, but you're allowed to ask like, you know, where'd you go to school or, you know, what training certifications did you go through? You know, don't be afraid that you're gonna maybe hurt their feelings or hit at their ego or something. Um, ask them questions, you know, get their credentials first. Don't just throw your money at an online coach because they might not even have a certification. They may just be doing this as a side gig to earn a little bit of extra cash. Um, so just please do your research. Please understand that there are some fantastic coaches out there. I know quite a few that, I mean, I look up to. They've helped me along my journey. They've given me plenty of tips and tricks and good books to read and things like that. But understand that there are frauds out there just as there is in every single industry. But do your research. Um, and I, I wish the best for y'all if you'll ever want to just ask a question about fitness or you, you just started your journey and you're not quite sure where to go with it or how to even approach it, please feel free to ask me questions. Comment you know, in the comment section below and I will definitely get to your questions. I'm not gonna charge you $100 to answer your question, but you know, I do offer online training. I do put my heart and soul into you know, the programming that I write and I don't just, it's not cookie cutter. I go through a lot in order to get the information that I need to even write you a plan. So if you're interested in online training, please comment below, please message me, email me, any way that you would need to get into contact with me, feel free to do so. Um, and yeah, and don't forget that I do also, you know, traditional training. That's what I love, that's what I have a passion for, is to be in person with somebody, to actually sit down with them, set goals with them, and then progress towards them with them. Um, so yeah, just understand that there are good people out there and there are bad people out there. Just do your research and you should be fine. Um, I just want to say thank y'all so much for listening to me rant, for watching this video, for, you know, being a little more sporadic than I'd like, but if y'all could just, you know, like, subscribe, get the message out there that, you know, people are starting YouTube and we might be a little bit late to the game, but 
understand that you know we want to grow i want to put out good content for you guys so any content that you want to see that you you know may not be seeing or just just let me know okay this channel is for y'all this channel is for content to help y'all in any way that i possibly can so thank you all for watching and thanks for you know supporting me